Greetings, everyone. Just want to quickly give you a word that God put on my heart as I'm sitting here in my car um, looking at the news. And I saw that uh, Zoom has some trouble with security. Yes, people are, are having meetings on Zoom. They're having classrooms on Zoom. And while they're giving their lectures, the hosts are experiencing people coming on there and hijacking the meetings with profanity, pictures, um, personal information. Um, so Zoom is having to now pull back and try to find ways to tighten up their security. Man, it feels like we're being hijacked by Corona. It feels like externals are being attacked. It feels as though when you're going to the store, people are not responding to and res responsible with social distancing. And you can't always control our externals. We can't always ex control the external environment. But I wanted to quickly tell you that um, we have something that can help us on the inside. And that's not always the easiest thing. The Bible says in Proverbs 3, verse 5 and 6, I'm quoting from not just the Bible, but Busy Billy, the storybook. Uh, Trust in the Lord with all your heart, but lean not unto your own understanding, but in all your ways acknowledge him, and he will direct your path. Just a quick word to say, uh, give God control of what's going on inside, your anxiety, your fear, your thoughts, uh, your goals, your plans. Give God complete control control. Uh, that's the only way we can be successful. We can make it in this life. The book of James says, uh, it says, God resists the proud, but the the humble he he draws near to and the humble he he loves and, and, and blesses. So I'm just here to remind you that God is able to do some amazing things if we just humble ourselves and give him complete control. We follow the authorities. Perhaps we'll find just the help and the hope that we need. And I'm asking everybody that you would just give God control of your heart. And watch God who is able, God who is truth, God who is the savior of the world, God who has a great plan. Watch him do some amazing things in your life. God bless you. Stay safe. Stay healthy. I'm praying for you.